this was the sod turning or groundbreaking for the new Lakes District Hospital and Health Centre and it's a $55 million project for Burns Lake that will completely replace the existing hospital and health centre. It's going to have 16 rooms in it. There will be a labour and delivery suite, there will be um, a procedure room, there will be also a, an isolation room. It will modernise the way that emergency services are provided and it will also enable the medical clinic and our community services to be co-located in the same building, which will really enable an integrated team approach to care in the region. Well, good morning, everyone. Uh, it's definitely a day of celebration. I think uh, you can look around the room and pretty much everyone has a smile on their face today. So uh, that's a good sign. Knowing that you have an adequate facility uh, to be built in your community is you know, it offers reassurance for those that are wanting to raise a family here, those that are wanting to invest uh, as, as a company, that they have that reassurance uh, for safety and health care services. The people in the community really put an enormous effort into making this become a reality. And so from a province, we were really responding to what was a, uh, a great uh, effort by many, many people. And so you wonder, when you're looking at health, there's so many priorities around the province for health. It is always a challenge to meet them all. And uh, this was one of those projects that came up that we were able to move forward because the health district stepped into place and, uh, and did that initial planning. We were able to get it going quickly. And the other partner, I think, has been Partnerships BC. Uh, any project like this, there's a major procurement process that you have to undertake in order to get from the uh, RFP stage through to the selection of who's going to do the construction of the project and uh, Partnerships BC was extremely helpful in moving that forward. The plans are fantastic, the renderings are amazing, uh, PCL has absolutely got a fantastic project on their hands and I know they'll deliver it. It makes sense to hire locally uh, from, from an economic perspective, why bring people in from the outside when uh, they're here? So we, we already have people on the ground talking to uh, local uh, and, and employees, local the trades, uh, meeting here and, and finding out who's available and uh, so that we can hire them and also help our, our subcontractors. If we know there are good electricians or good plumbers or, or otherwise uh, other uh, trades, then uh, we'll pass that on to our, to our subcontractors. Construction will be starting uh, shortly and we're hoping that this facility will be ready for occupation and for opening and, and operation in the fall of 2015.